Hi, this is our September edition of the most interesting news that happened in digital health over the past month. Tesla received FDA 510K clearance for its patch-like blood collection device. The company said the clearance will allow pharmaceutical companies to use the device for decentralized clinical trials, while healthcare systems and physicians could utilize it for patient care. No-code platforms are getting more and more popular and approaching digital health. Pattern Health, which offers a platform for building digital health tools, announced it had raised $3.3 million in Series A funding. Pattern provides a no-code platform to help clinicians and researchers create digital health programs like apps, clinical decision support tools, and surveys. Duckbody, a Singapore-based online networking platform for healthcare professionals, has snapped up $44 million in a Series C funding round. With the aim of helping doctors be more informed and make better clinical decisions, Duckbody provides a platform for more than 350,000 doctors to learn, connect, and collaborate through knowledge exchange and verified content across specialties. In the end, we'd like to share the results of a study published by JAMA Network Open that says that diagnosis from preliminary telehealth consultations matched in-person visits in 86.9% of cases. This breaks a huge myth that the quality of online consultations is very poor. So hopefully, the telemedicine platforms will continue to develop and reach every single patient on the planet. Stay safe and please support Ukraine.